The man who controlled the box, the guy who regulated the box, came in, two-time Super Bowl champion, a member of the all-decade team, the team of the 90s, 24 career interceptions, Steve Atwater. And now let's bring in my buddy Steve Atwater, the nine-time finalist, nine-time semifinalist. Steve, welcome to the show, man. Congratulations on being here. How you feel right now? I feel pretty good. I really do. And uh, I want to say congratulations to the other uh, finalists. Uh, man, John Lynch uh, again, uh, Leroy Butler, uh, Darren Woodson. Congratulations to those guys. Uh, you know, I, on this list, you can't really go wrong with whoever you pick. So uh, I'm in good company. All right, Steve, my homeboy from St. Louis. <laughs> this is uh, Steve White <laughs> hitting you up right here. You know, it's, it's interesting, you know, seeing the last couple of years, seeing Ed, Ed Reed and Brian Dawkins go in there. And these were big hitters like you. These were playmakers like you. Do you think the fact that we're starting to see safeties get mentioned more to go into the Pro Football Hall of Fame opens up an opportunity for you? Uh, I think it definitely does. And I, I think that the safety position has been overlooked over the years. Uh, fortunately, we, you know, we were able to get in Kenny Easley and then uh, Ed Reed here last year. Uh, you know, that's a great uh, really thing for all the safeties uh, who – Again, I, I think I've been under overlooked and kind of underrepresented in the Pro Football Hall of Fame. You know, Steve, Jim Trotter here. You were a member of an all-decade team. You were a guy who was a physical presence on the back end. Offensive coordinators would put your picture up and say, we got to account for that guy if we're sending anyone over the middle, that sort of thing. Can you put into words what this weight has been like for you? Because um, personally, I'm surprised that it has taken this long that you're not in. So what has this weight been like personally for you? Well, I, I tell you what, I, I was patient in the early years. I'm, I'm really starting to get antsy. I'm, you know, getting near that 25-year mark. And uh, as you know, once you go over to the seniors pool, it, uh, it's, it's really tough to get in once you get to that point. Uh, so I'm really hoping that at some point it happens here. I've always said that, you know, if it's meant to be, it'll be. Uh, but I'm, I'm hoping that uh, I can, you know, encourage other people to uh, get me over the hump this year. Uh, I, I think that I'm deserving uh, and – you know, I would represent the Pro Football Hall of Fame well. Steve, I can't, uh, I'd be remiss if I don't bring up your signature hit. You know what that is. That's that Christian Okoye hit that uh, the world was watching. I remember watching that and, and thinking, wow, that was just an incredible hit. How much do you think about that? And how much do people talk to you about that hit? Well, yeah, that's the one hit when, you know, I talk to most people, they bring that hit <laughs> up and, you know, uh, I, I would imagine the same thing for Christian Okoye. Uh, it's, uh, it's unfortunate from his end, but I uh, have nothing but respect for him. He's a great, great man. Uh, but, yeah, that, that, that was uh, a hit that I think put me on the map. And uh, a lot of the young guys today, they'll go and uh, take a look at that hit and say, wow, how, how did you do that? So uh, it's, uh, I was fortunate to be able to come out on the right side of that play. Steve, you played on a lot of great defenses. And, and to me, it's shocking that the Broncos don't really have that many defensive players on the hall. Champ Bailey went in, went in last year. But you got Randy Gratishow. You got Carl Mecklenburg. And we have you who are not in the and hall. Dennis Smith. Yes, and Dennis yes. Smith. I mean, talk to me about that and, and why you think that's the case. You know what? I, I don't really know. Uh, it, it is frustrating, you know, a team that's, uh, you know, we had back-to-back -back Super Bowl wins and we don't have anybody rep representing us in the Pro Football Hall of Fame. I think we're the only team that's like that. Uh, but I, I don't know. I, hopefully things are starting to change and uh, we're starting to get a little bit more recognition and uh, we'll get some guys in here uh, hopefully this year. All right, Steve, before we let you go, I got to let the whole world know that in high school back at Lutheran North, we came out of St. Louis the same time together. You were a quarterback, man. All we see are hits of you knocking people out. But see, that's, that's, that's why I got to be such a good safety because when I threw those interceptions, man, I, <laughs> I had to win them. <laughs> All right, Steve, congratulations, hey, congratulations again, man. Steve. Thanks so much for joining us. Hey, thanks so much, guys. Have a great day.